Miss Meredith, go ahead. We'll go from left to right. <laughs> no gifts this time. Oh, that's why we went first. <laughs> Uh, the reason I'm speaking on Bitcoin, I'm, I'm certainly not an expert, but I did consulting in that industry too. And one thing I want to mention is there's different technologies. There's proof of work versus proof of, proof of stake. Proof of work mining is much more energy intensive than proof of stake. So do consider some of those kinds of considerations. Um, I do, the, the guy that talked about uh, the, the large scale uh, uh, Bitcoin centers, I think there's a, a logical reason to have them require like energy storage. And if he's smart, he's going to do that anyway, because they can keep running even when the small guys can't. So that's a consideration because this is an industry that can go out to a lot of people all over the state and rural areas and so on. So there's some of these things are really good for the state if you look at it from that kind of perspective for the rural areas. I do want to mention, though, it, it, you know, I don't know if you guys have ever worked with uh, chat GPT or AI yet. If you haven't, just think about that, that you haven't yet, and so many people have not. And it, it, the amount of energy it uses, it's an exponential growth curve. You know, it's going to go sky high. So you've got to focus on do not limit the amount of supply. We need to be really looking at this. So the other part of it is the demand side. And so that's where I think that there does need to be a focus is to counterbalance it with efficiency. As I said, we had an energy efficiency company. HVAC, by the way, the things on that uh, emissions uh, chart I gave you is a lot of it is HVAC related. When the differential between the high temperatures and, the, and how cool you want to get in the house, it's going to affect the amount of hard, you know, hydrocarbons and also you know, the uh, energy use. So make sure that we, so my recommendations are look at the computer industry, look at storage and as a, a way to make dispatchable power. It would have made a difference in URI and we were five and a half days without energy and my husband was on chemo. That was a big deal to me. Um, look for regional solutions and look, so look at the system architecture like a computer network, you know, that there's things. Oh, and I've got more, but whatever. Go ahead, finish it. You've got 30 seconds. Okay. Um, also, um, Oh, just, uh, yeah, the other parts of it is to re reward and recognition. If you want to get people involved, you know, we've got to reduce demand. And so that's the, the idea with the hats is let's mega, having a rallying cry. But also look at, instead of gloom and doom, look at reward and recognition for individuals and to get them on board. And there's lots of ways to do that with energy efficiency. Um, yeah, anyway, uh, and also look at the generation opportunities that would be available at the substation kind of thing if you de designed it for revenue if you designed it that way. So. Thank you, Ms. Mary. Questions?